welcome back to our Hape Quadrilla Advanced Coding class. Did you try out our previous challenges? I hope you did and you succeeded. Today we are going to continue our exciting marble journey. Buckle up and let's go! Firstly, let's read the challenge card, which is the junior level challenge number 9. And I will see you once you finish your build. Here is our build. Now, a kind reminder, even though the cards do not show the accelerator parts, remember to always use it in a proper way and make sure that the marbles run in a certain speed to reach the ending point. Now, after we have it, we can see that the secret block actually is the starting point, which is a little tricky. So first of all, we have to analyze the possible path of the starting block and then debug each path one by one. According to the challenge card, the red marbles need to roll out from the yellow block. Now, the secret block has three obvious possible paths. The first option is leftward path, the second one is straight down path, and the third one is the rightward one. Now, let's test these possibilities by trial and error. Well, let's look at the first option. If the path of the secret block goes towards the left side, it is not hard for us to imagine that the marble is going to roll into the blue block and then all of them would fall out of the rail. Clearly, the leftward path is not an option. Well, let's move on to the second option, whose path is straight one connecting the top to the bottom. Let's find block with one straight path and try it out. Uh huh. Seems like the orange block clearly meets our needs. Let's try it. And release the marbles. Here we go. The two red marbles did roll out of the yellow block, so the straight path is a correct answer. Well, let's think for a second. Are there any other answers? As we saw, the straight path is the right direction. So we just need to find the blocks that have at least one straight path. Mm, I remember the natural block has it. Oh, but we don't have one. Should I show you magic? Let's go. Here it is. Let's try. Here go the marbles. Awesome! So the natural block also works. Alright, now let's look at the next option. We need to find a piece with a rightward path. Hmm, how about the turquoise? It has one rightward path, so let's try it. Get the marbles from here and let's release. Awesome! Seems like the right word option is also a correct answer. But think, do we have other pieces that can also work? The answer will be left for you to find out after the class. In this challenge, we don't know the starting block since we had the secret block. So in this case, we analyze the challenge card first and come out with three possible paths of the secret block according to the building. After the analysis, we replace the different blocks to debug each possibilities one by one and finally confirm the correct answers. This kind of problem solving method is what we call the process of elimination. In this way, we can figure out the correct answer based on what we already know. Hope everyone can learn about this excellent method and apply it to practice in the future. Alright, in the next class, we will carry on our marble journey. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.